Hello everyone, Salty Head here on another adventure. This time we're back up in the state of Maine, up to the Forks. I love this place, there's so much to do. This time we're gonna do things a little bit different. We're gonna go full wheeling. We're gonna go back and do the whitewater rafting trip on the Kennebec. We're also gonna do some whitewater raft uh, tubing. And we're gonna, we always look for moose. And we're gonna hike out to Moxie Falls. Check that out, do some swimming. And so please join me on another wonderful adventure here in the state of Maine with Salty Head. Here we are, we just arrived at our new log cabin. It's called the Tamarack. And we're gonna go check it out. But uh, it's got like five bedrooms, and a loft. It's really, uh, it's quite big inside. And all woods here. And if we pan around here, we got picnic tables, we got a fire pit, and it's right on the water. Very nice. So now we're off and running on another adventure, this time tubing on the Kennebec. It's $35 per tube and we're gonna get an extra one for our cooler. And they pick you up by bus right over here. And they take you to the river, drop you off, and then they pick you up. And it's a lot of fun. Today we have kind of an overcast day, but it'll still be nice to see. Uh, it's warm out, so that's good. And parking's across the street. And here you have to fill out the liability forms to release Three Rivers of any responsibility because you're on your own. Wow. The first is foot entrapment. There's a reason why we don't stand up in the river. Say you're like, oh, it's really shallow. Let me show my friends how shallow it is. What's gonna end up happening is your foot's gonna get stuck. So here's where we get set up. Here's the tubes, life preservers. Right on the Kennebec. Here they come. Here's that group. What's our tribe name? The uh, the Kennebecians. And this is our little group. Seven little Indians going down the river. And uh, we've got kind of a overcast day, but that's okay. They actually, the water temperature right now is 71 degrees, so we're good. <laughs> Get stuck on a rock. <laughs> mm -hmm. Not so bad. No, because we were bouncing off of those rocks with our feet, remember? Because, Mom, that, there's actually like more water. Rick, last I mean, year I, we, I were, we were kind of yeah. bouncing so along on that side, yeah. bouncing off the rocks. No, 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 wow. Yeah. You spend a lot of time in Maine, Mike. Yeah? Good good place to relax? Yeah. Bones don't work. Yeah. Go old school. It's the last frontier. Other than Alaska. 
So we're rafting out of Three Rivers and it lasts about two hours and 15 minutes. And you know, you don't do much of anything. You just sit here and, and drink and talk and, and float. It's kind of, Enjoy your company. it's kind of a nice way to spend the, uh, the day. And uh, they leave about 12 o'clock. So that's when the river is at, at its peak and the water height only lasts about two and a half hours. So um, yeah, it's a lot of fun. Now we head back to Three Rivers, go take some showers and have a nice hot lunch. So right now we're going to play log cabin basketball. So that's just, that's going to have everything for yeah, the whole nice little fire going. Yeah. That's a, tonight is, tonight is a uh, sausage. That, well, that's fishing. Hot sausage. Yeah. yeah. Deli style. So if you have a test, can you study for it? No. It's all common sense. Yeah. Looking good. If you hire, uh, if you hire a nice sausage with yeah. peppers yeah. and yeah. onions. Yeah. And One of the things that makes Maine so special is the trees. There's many and they're quite large. Here's an example of a couple of white pines. And see how tall they grow? That's typical of Maine. There's trees and more trees and more trees. Right now it's 7 a.m. and it's time to get up, the sun is up, and go get our rafting clothing on for another fun day on the Kennebec River. It's gonna be a beautiful day here, up in the Forks of Maine. right these are cool these little rails this thing costs like five million dollars to build is that right uh i've heard about a quarter million but you know five million sounds good <laughs> yeah they put these in actually after 9 11. wow uh, what used to happen if you came 20 years ago you might remember blake i don't know when i came i was like 12 years old for the first time we didn't have these stairs this is good they had the boats all filled up at the parking lot. They had to carry them all the way down this long driveway. So our water level is pretty much up to 5,000. There's a few markers. Totally all apart. Get right before we kind of drop into the hole, I'll yell, hold on. What are you going to do? Up, paddles out. Paddles out. Max, 
There you go. Paddle out, grab the rope, big smile. All right. All right. The film, the picture. Okay. But we're not holding on through the whole rapid. That won't do us any good. So just hold on for the first hit, and then be ready for those paddle commands. It's a good workout. We'll pull over afterwards and take a good breather. You guys ready? Yeah. All ahead. Right now we're, we're at Moxie Falls. We're just above the main waterfall and we're gonna go for a swim. We just had a nice lunch. Part of the whitewater package is they offer you a choice of steak, chicken or fish for lunch. And it was really delicious with some rice and some uh, cold beans. And so now we're just gonna go for a swim, relax, drink some beverages, maybe talk about the day. And uh, so yeah, this is part of this wonderful adventure here in Maine. travel up and down 201. They kind of rule the road, these logging trucks. So this is Northern Outdoors where you can have a drink, sit around by the pool, just relax, or have dinner. Good morning, everyone. I rolled out of bed pretty early this morning, around 5.30, hoping to catch a glimpse of a moose. But uh, even though they're as big as a horse, they're not that easy to find, and I've been looking. So today we're gonna, we're gonna rent some uh, four-wheelers and we're gonna head up to Greenville from the Forks. And it's about a four-hour round trip. So it should be, uh, the weather looks like it's gonna rain, but 
we're, we're all set. We're, we'll have some fun. And so right now I'm gonna head back for breakfast and go get some machines. Okay. So everybody's just getting ready to go on their rides. White watering, tubing, <laughs> walking, hiking, bird watching. Everybody's got an agenda today. So this is John. He's uh, he's the uh, guy, not the guy, but he's the guy that rent us the uh, the ATVs. And over here we have all the helmets, and we get goggles. It's all part of the package. Look at this machine! Wow. What are these called? Four wheelers or pull up? I mean, um, these are side by sides. Side by side. They don't call them razors or anything, right? No, razor is just a different model. Oh, okay. It's already got a zip tie in it. Hold the headlight. Okay, this is my rig. And we're looking for any kind of problems. Are these brand new? Uh, brand new this year, yep. These are 2021. Wow, okay. This one has, let's see, 471 miles on it. All right, so it looks pretty good. Do you see anything, John? No, I didn't see anything. Okay, all right, so I guess we're good. I don't see anything either, but... So we made it up to Moxie Lake, right here at the dam, and we got lost so many times. We're not going to make it to Greenville today, but it sure is beautiful here on Moxie Lake. Well, I hope you enjoyed this video. I always enjoy coming up to the state of Maine. There's always so much to see and do. And as you can see behind me, there's plenty of lumber, so it just needs to be milled and the prices should come down soon. And so until next time, this is Salty Head here in Jackman, Maine, and thank you for watching.